Well, the impact is significant. As we've seen, the NSE didn't trade for a while this morning because of it, and it just reinforces how reliant we are as an economy on connectivity. Uh, if you look at our case as Access Kenya, we have bought capacity on three different routes to Mombasa, and all three of them were down today. And this is just completely unacceptable, not just to us as operators, but also to, to consumers whose businesses are completely reliant on it. Uh, I think it's very important that the government uh, step in, as they did last year, in terms of deliberate cable cuts and now step in and really look at financially penalizing people who inadvertently cut cables so that there's a huge financial penalty so that people are much more careful about what they do when they dig up and down roads and they at least engage operators in advance with uh, finding out where their cables are so that they're much more careful about cutting these cables that are critical to the country people are so reliant on connectivity, if they're completely down, then what do they have to do other than maybe do some, some of their paperwork that they need to do? Everything is done on email today. Everything is done on connectivity, uh, voice over IP circuits, etc., etc. And so the, the impact to all the businesses who were affected uh, today or with, with the multiple cuts between Nairobi and Mombasa, um, the, it, it's very hard to put a figure on it, but for sure they're not very happy today and nor are we.